living in the transformation age. That means we've got to get comfortable with risk and uncertainty and we were not taught how to do that. So what I want to bring you today is a really simple, workable framework. We're going to go into uncertainty, we're going to stretch ourselves, we're going to go into risk. Little voices of self-doubt will begin to speak to us in our heads and we will want to back off. So let's call it the tiger. We hold the pen and we are writing the story of our lives and we will choose how to move that story forward. And we'll get to look back on 90 years of decision, action, result, every moment of every day whilst we are awake and ask, did I write my story heart and soul from the, from the, from the gut? And we need to become aware of that because one day we will not be in this situation. We do new things that we believe will take us to a new place. That's transformation, it's real simple. We worked with Jim on our 2019 sales kickoff. We thought his Taming the Tiger fitted perfectly with our theme. We gave a brief to Jim, which he, you know, he joined a call, he gave us a lot of time to help us understand how we linked. As Jim finished, I was already thinking, what, what do I want to do this year? I said, I don't think I often think about that, that life plan enough. So it did make me think there is something I've wanted to do for a long time and, and maybe 2019 it gave gave me a bit of an edge to say, why not do it this year? Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jim Lawless. Thank you very much, what a warm welcome. How are you? We're living in the transformation age. That means we've got to get comfortable with risk and uncertainty and we were not taught how to do that. Let's call it the tiger. In the moment, there's that senior person in the client. I could really do with a conversation with them. In the moment, the tiger roars and we find we've backed off. This story is not going anywhere fast, is it? Until the thing happens, the tornado comes, it lifts up her house, and when she wakes up, she's in the land of Oz, in the middle of the biggest musical theatre number the world has seen to this point. Change starts with a thing, an event. That creation is courageous, there's no urgency behind it, forcing us to do it, and it involves us deciding to enter uncertainty and risk and see whether we can swim out there. I didn't want to cold call really senior people and ask them to help me. Do you? <laughs> Why not? Transformation, adaptation, uncertainty, risk. Why not? Let's analyze this. How do we take a decision to rise above ourselves, helicopter up, and to allow our heroic human self, the courageous self that wants to make new happen, that wants to pioneer, that wants to win, that wants to create legacy, that wants to make a contribution. How do we take that self, go up and look at that self and enable it to win over the safe self that wants to make sure it's all okay? We are human. We have all the skills necessary to transform and adapt. And we also have the ability to hold ourselves back. And finally, we have the ability to go up and decide which one's going to win. So as I walk over, I'm thinking, I'm going to go and speak to that fabulous person. And the map, the rule book, the belief system is going to say to me, bad idea. Ooh. Why? That's a very beautiful person. I know, I know, I don't want to seem shallow, but that was part of the thing. <laughs> but you're not very good looking, are you? Ooh. Ooh, yeah, okay, fair, good feedback. Would you think I could compensate for that with some witty, charming conversation based on past experience? No. We're either working with our purpose, which requires risk and uncertainty, or we're being run by the system, the algorithm, which protects us. You hold the pen. You are writing the story. You will decide the pace of this transformation. What is the chapter that you will decide to write as you leave London here, January? 2019. Thank you so much for your hospitality. It's been a real pleasure spending time with you. Thank you.